There is no one woman in this world that you would speak to that would not tell you that they haven't gone through some sort of sexual abuse. I was 10 years old when it happened to me. Day, women have to suffer and to adjust to continue toil in their marriage, in their relationship, even in their family. Their uncle will rape, their mommy will tell them, no, keep quiet, you can't say anything. Fathers raping their daughters, gate man, cleaner, your own brother, someone that they put in trust of your own child is raping your child. How do you explain to that child when they get older that somebody that you trusted did that to them? You're not safe anywhere. We're just tired. Yeah, but my case, you're not safe. Cinema, you're not safe. The house, you're not safe. The mosque, you're not safe. The church, you're not safe. You're not safe anywhere. We're just tired. They just leave us. Eight months old, 12 years old, 10 years old, 20 something. Whatever age that you may be, even an 80 year old woman is being raped and you're telling me about what someone wears. I mean, look at the case of Uwaila. This was a girl who was in church to read. It didn't matter what she was wearing. It didn't matter where she was. What matter was someone took advantage of their power to go and violate another person in, in the church and kill her. Rape is not about the dressing. It's a deliberate act to violate someone's right. And those who take that deliberate action must be brought to book, period. This station has somebody. Somebody who will usually ask questions. Please let the person come and ask us why we are here. Yes. I am assuring you yes, that wherever you have any concern, you come to me or you come to any senior police officer. We are willing and always willing to listen to you and address your concerns. Protecting rapists. It's not going to happen. It does not happen here again. I want you to know. Everywhere we are going to be shaming or we are going to be naming rapists. What I'm wearing does not give you consent. It's a dress, not a yes. It's not by force. No is no. Read the placard. Behave yourselves, men. Not the only one that gets sexual urge. Behave yourselves. Stop putting our shirt. Stop putting our hair. Stop putting our hair. Just leave us alone. Raise your men. Raise your boys. Raise your friends to respect women. Tell them and inform them. Understand the meaning of consent. Okay, I've not held her down, so I've not raped her. Plus the coercion, plus the persuasion, plus the sweet talking. Please now, just the tip now. You're all part of it. You're all part of rapist behavior. You're all part of forcing somebody for consent. Any other thing than an enthusiastic yes is a no.